Welcome back, guys, to Let's Play Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes Back. And we are gonna go do some levels. And I believe we want to go down this path. No, not that path. This one. Let's try this one first. Because I think this leads to a portal to another. Yep, the giant bear opens a secret passage. And I know which one. It's like the boulder levels, except we're running away from a giant bear. A polar bear, to be exact. This is for me stepping on their sun. They're very mad at that. Really mad. Kind of makes you wonder the eco the not the economy, the ecosystem of the Crash Bandicoot universe, because it doesn't look good. I mean, you got... What diet are they on that makes them so big? Did Cortex give them something? Probably. Now I remember in the um, old Crash games, you could come back to these guys and they would kill you. Because they would chomp on you and, like, laugh. But I guess they removed that from this version. Keep moving, just keep running. And we should be fine. So we're gonna hit the checkpoint here, but we're actually gonna go this way. See? Gotta dodge bullets. Oh, there's something there. Ah, oh, that's just the shadow of the middle box. Okay. Gotta dodge bullets. Oops, not dodging them like that. Oh, damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. Almost had it. Don't break. Now I have to die again. Thanks for that. time we did it right. Dodge the bullets. Dodge the bullets. Will that be all misty pool? Cats. Cats don't dance. Ah, oh, damn it. He didn't do the jump I wanted. Alright, one more time. If we keep failing, I'm gonna cut it. when I get there. Okay, here we go. Ah. Nice try, game, but you can't trick me. I can read your mind. What? No! 
You mean to tell me it was all for nothing? Nothing? Yours. Boy. Who we called that last time? Fuck it. Aha! Not today. I thought that was, I thought we were done. There we go. Where we go? Fun time. You know what? That's fine. You know what? I'm okay with it. Because we almost got everything. Take me to the bonus. That would count as a checkpoint. <laughs> See? Matt's a genius. Never underestimate the power of Nate. He's smart. And he's charming. And he's handsome. And he's a narcissist. Please don't unsuch me. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Oh, I see. I need to use the nitro bar. Great. Aha! Only 16 more. Run away from the polar bear! He's mean! They thought they could run from me. Stupid. In three more boxes. Oh, and there they are. Now, I think they will explode when the polar bear hits them. So, we should avoid them. He should. Yeah, there we go. No, I actually think there's one more thing we gotta do here. I think it's this one. Yes, yes, it's this one. But first, we're gonna go get our gem. Our well-earned gem. There it is. Then we're gonna go back. To our polar bear friend who we thought the other polar bear just murdered. That's not true, because it's a warp gate! Four? Totally bear. And we go send our gems and our crystals along. But we're not we're not gonna do the crash dance because that's not the last warp level. Oh yeah, it's this one! The totally dark area. I don't recall this actually being that bad, but Oh, I forgot the super dash. Shit. That's okay. I got you, bear! Now I got a super dash at that point. Perfect. Kill the whales. Oh no! No, 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 no. I, I, no, I messed that up. I missed the box. I missed a box. I gotta go back. And no, if you reach this secret warp point and you think you can just jump into another level, no, because each secret warp, warp zone unlocks that specific warp gate. So, you can't just come here and be like, Oh, well, now I'm just gonna jump into a totally different level. Fuck the one that the one this one wants me to do. So, damn. I forgot to super, I forgot to super dash. 
Why does the polar bear bark? Polar bears are not dogs. They're bears. Very, very mean creatures. I missed that. I saw that. Don't get the time clock, you fool. Okay, we're gonna try that again. There we go. Dodge the killer whales. Perfect, there we go. Oof, that was close. Good job. Aha! Checkpoint. Oh yeah, and those guys! Goody! But so far, so good. I was ready for you this time. Aha! Nice try. Now you think going down here would be of use or anything, but no. You will die. That's in a later level. Or, we already did that. I don't remember. It's been a while since I've played Crash 2. I've been playing LA Noir a lot. But anyways, that's two levels. Ba bam We still need to unlock the one from Totally Fly. Air Crash. Yeah, I still gotta do that. Snow Go and Road to Ruin. Oh, you can access it. But that doesn't mean you can still go through all the portals you want. Just because you can go there doesn't mean you can do everything. So. There you go. Uh, we're going to do Bear Down next. Tap Run before to jump a great... I know. I just did a level that required me to do it. Hey, buddy! That bear probably wishes he never saw Crash ever again. Ah. <laughs> just, just, ah. Yeah, that bear looks like he's not happy to see Crash at all. I mean, can you blame him? It's Crash Bandicoot. He's going through a very tough breakup, and he's doing this as a way to fight the pain. Crash is a very, very lonely creature. Ah, crap, I missed that. Let's try again. There we go. Ah, crap. Ah, shit. I wasn't even paying attention. Hold up a second. Okay, back to it. Shit. <laughs> Didn't miss a beat. Damn it. Ah! <laughs> oh, that's it. 
<laughs> that's getting a that's getting a meme treatment there. There we go. Shit. Okay. There we go. Got that box. You can't fool me. Ah, yes, we have to hit the nitro crate. No, trigger box. Bye! Bye, Mr. Powder Bay. Alright, like last time, let's get the gem. And let's go hit up the secret warp. Shit! There we go. Like I said, I already got the gem, so it doesn't matter. Ah, here we go. I was wondering where that led to, and now we know. I'll have to go back to air crash and complete that. Oh, wait, hold on. Crash, thank goodness! Hi! I hacked into Cortex's computer and found detailed schematics for an improved Cortex Vortex huh? suspicious-looking space station. Okay! I'm not sure, but Cortex might be trying to... Uh-huh. Whatever. <laughs> I can't even get the special gem. Fuck it, I'll get it later. This isn't about air crash. This is about the third floor and the boss fight that goes with it. We're gonna do Road to Ruin. And they fixed the glitch in this area so you can't jump over it. Like, you have to take the actual warp gate to from to get to the left from the left there they've made sure that you can't screw around like that you know that little guy looks pretty cute I didn't want to hurt it I feel so sorry for hurting these little guys I'm sorry now we got to be careful So we can get the death plot the no death platform. Which should be right here. And once we touch it, it'll be ours forever. And now that we touched it. Okay. This is gonna be a bit of a problem. We're not done yet. I'm not done yet, Catherine from Valkyria Chronicles. Might do a let's play on that game. I'm having quite a bit of fun on it. And so far, so far only one challenge has really gotten under my skin. That's the fifth special mission, and anyone who's played the first Valkyria Chronicles knows exactly my pain. go and touch that. I want to see if there's anything here. Well, we won't be able to come back, so... Death platform it is! Oh yeah, that's right. You can do that! I completely forgot you could do that! And screw this being one of the hardest parts. Fuck 
you, dude. To think I got headaches from you. I'm gonna wait for the monkeys. Monkey. I saw the tr the English dub trailer for the new Broly movie, the second one. And I know not a lot of people like the dub, but to be honest, I love the fact that the guy voicing Frieza is just having the time of his life with oh, ho, ho. Hello monkeys. I'm just it just makes me happy. You see, I even, I even missed the crystal. Holy crap. I'm just feeling happiness that the act voice actor for Frieza is having fun. And if you can be inter and if you're having a fun time doing a dub, then really, it can be all right. I mean, I'm preferring more subs than dubs myself, but to be honest, sometimes the dubs just are so hilarious that I prefer them over the sub. Though I did see the monster, the did see clips of the Monster Musume dub, and to be honest, I was not impressed. The main problem with dubs is that they have voices coming out of the characters that just, they just don't fit, you know? Like, My Hero Academia. Like, we were curious to see the dub of that, so my brother and I are watch we're watching a dub, and Deck and um, Bakugo... He does not sound like anything like I expected him. Like, his Japanese voice makes sense. He's loud. He's arrogant. He's very, very angry for some reason. But um, when I hear the dubber, he's like, Oh, you got a problem, Deku. And I'm like, uh, no, that doesn't work. Uh, Deku's... Deku's is alright. I mean, I don't like Deku anyway, so... Ah, monkey! He was clearly a Deku fan, and he wanted me to know that he was disappointed in my choice. But he's he's all right. I don't like his chat. I don't like his voice as a kid. If we're gonna be perfectly fair, yeah, I knew I'd miss that gem because of the fact that I couldn't go to the second point. Uh. All Might's actually sounds pretty good if he put a little bit more effort into it. I mean, it's Piccolo's voice actor. I think Chris Sabat, I believe. And he actually is doing a pretty good job. But the problem is, is that he's not giving himself that extra oomph he needs to be All Might is here! You know, that. I mean, yeah, he says like, I am here. And that's pretty heroic, but it doesn't have the same kick as the Japanese for the sub. I'm just going to prefer it to the sub. And we're just going to leave it at that. So, the dub for me is a mixed bag. And I'm just going to leave it at that. I might actually continue to watch watch it just to see how much more I'm either going to be disappointed or be like, oh, this is funny. Okay, we have to get the yellow gem. Which we didn't get. So, there's that. I don't really want to get into too much talks about dubs versus subs because everybody has their own opinion. They think this is cool. They think that's cool. They think this should just die in a ditch. And I just say that all forms of race are equal and anyone who thinks otherwise is a complete nincompoop and doesn't deserve any form of insurance. As you are slowly hit by a car. <laughs> that's enough of that. But enough about me, let's talk about you! Hi. 
That's a game I need to do a let's play of. Abe's Odyssey, new and tasty. I mean, I did a stream of it, and it was okay. It wasn't good. It was okay. But uh, I also want to try to get 100% on that. You tried to get 100%, man. You tried, but you didn't. You didn't. Hey, speaking about things I didn't do, guess who didn't get the yellow gem? This guy. Am I going to get it? Yes. Am I going to have to come back here and do this all over again? Yes. But I'm going to save that for later episodes. Basically, a little bonus episodes of me scrounging about all the gems before the final one. got two ways to go. We have options. You can't harm me. Okay, there's the exit. But I haven't even gotten the crystal. I think this way is the crystal. The crystal. The dark Carefling! It is a Carefling! I heard they're gonna make a mini series, like a small mini series on Netflix about it. Oh shit! I did get all of it! Wait a minute, then what? What good is the, what good is the yellow gem in this part? You know what? Whatever! I'm just gonna take my victory and leave! I'm going to take my ball and go home. How about that? Oh, who would like to see me play a, uh, a more adult game for a Let's Play? I'm talking about, like, South Park. And I'm talking about South Park, the Stick of Truth, and the Fractured Butthole. Wouldn't that be neat? I would totally... Oh, that's right. The yellow gem is for another gem altogether. That's fine. You know what? Whatever. Okay. And that should be the... Yep. This is the last one before we call it an episode before, after the boss fight. I had to cut a few things out, but overall, I think... Beat the timer to earn a special gem. Done. Challenge accepted. Damn it! I didn't even get to it. Okay, let's not try to show off. Because we clearly can't. So, that Spyro game is supposed to be coming out in November of this year. That's pretty cool. Well, I'm not gonna lie. I never really spiroed. Nope. That's my confession. I've I've never played a Spyro game. At least to its completion. I played Spyro one, but I never beat it. Wesker did this to me. Wesker! Umbrella! Quickly, quickly! Oh, wait a minute, I think this is where I needed an Aku Aku. Oh, wait, no. Alright. You know what? We're gonna grab the crystal ahead of time, because screw it, why not? Okay, I got an Aku Aku, it's fine, go.
Aha! The yellow gem is mine! Now it's time to go die and get the rest. That I might have missed. Did I miss any back here? Oh, they're hippos. Okay. I just want to make sure I didn't miss any boxes back there. You know what? I'll figure it out. Fuck it. Moving on. Ooh, that was close. So many nitro. Okay. Just want to make sure they exploded. They gonna explode, mama! Oh, that horrible kid. Collect everything, I guess. No! What am I doing? Sounds like an old hillbilly who's being bullied by the spirits of his ancestors. Fun time. Fuck up. No, I didn't. <laughs> We're done here. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. -zo. Okay, that's it. And now we got one fight. Alright, you can crash dance. Crash dance! Oh yeah! Crash dance! Oh yeah! Oh, who is it? Crash, my boy. Hi! You are more than halfway there. Yay! But I'm sure you've noticed that things are getting harder. The last ten uh -huh. crystals will be the hardest to gather, and my... <laughs> our enemies will be sending their strongest uh -huh. forces to thwart you. I'll contact you again when you have completed the next warp room. Okay. But yeah, the final bo the boss in this area is Tiny Tiger, and this is the last of any any other bosses. Then it's Embryo and then Cortex. I find it hilarious though that they actually worked for they these first floor enemies like Ripperoo, Kom Komodo Brothers, and now Tiny. I find it hilarious that they're actually all working for um, Embryo. Ha, you dumb bastard. He was really not the brightest, is he?
<laughs> oh no! That's okay. I actually like this fight. Delicious karma. I hope it was worth it, you fuck. Didn't make it there. That thing just felt like being a dick. But that's it for this, then. We're done. Tiny Tiger is beaten. Alright, let's head up. And this is where some of the worst levels in the game is. I'm not even kidding. But anyways, that's going to do it for Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes Back. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like, comment, subscribe, and visit my Patreon, which is going to be at the end of this video and in the description. Okay, see you later. Bye.